The night sky was aglow with shining stars. Among them was a tiny twinkling star. He looked down to the earth and was amazed to see a house shining brighter than any star. Daddy star, whose house is this that shines so bright? Twinkle wondered with shimmering eyes. He had never seen such a luminous house. Oh, my little shine. This house you see is the house of Sayyida Fatma Zahra. Peace be upon her. The only daughter of the last prophet. Peace be upon him and his progeny. And the wife of Hazrat Ali. Peace be upon him. Daddy Star continued with a glee in his voice that made Twinkle excited. This is the house where the angels descend. And this is the house where her little sons Hassan and Hussain, peace be upon them, play along with their younger sisters Sayyida Zainab and Umm Kulthum, peace be upon them. Look down, Twinkle. This is the time when Sayyida Fatma, peace be upon her, was born in the arms of Lady Khadija, peace be upon her. Makkah was the place and 20th of Jamadi Usani was the date. The Prophet, peace be upon him and his progeny, was delighted at the birth of a daughter, the promised Gothar. Daddy, why is she called Zahra? Tell me more about her in this beautiful moonlight. Oh, my little one, she was given the name Zahra because when she stands in prayer in the presence of her Lord, her light illuminates the skies for the angels, just as stars shine for the people on earth. The Prophet, peace be upon him and his progeny, loved her so much. He said that the one who loves her will be in heaven with him, and the one who is an enemy to her will burn in fire. Daddy Star paused for a moment and then smiled. He knew Twinkle wanted to know more, so he told, My dear Twinkle, she cared her father like a mother cares for her child. That is why she was known as Umme Abiha. She is a guiding light. She is the role model for the Imam of our time. May Allah hasten his reappearance. She is among the best women of paradise and the mistress of all the women from the beginning to the end. She is blessed with the title Sayyidatun Nisal Alameen. No wonder she said, that we, the Ahlul Bayt, peace be upon them all, are the means of communications between the Lord and His creations. We are the chosen ones, the pure. To us belong the divine authority, and we are the heirs of the Prophet, peace be upon him and his progeny. Oh, wow, Daddy! Now I know why the house of Sayyidah Fatima, peace be upon her, shines so bright. She is just too awesome, right? She sure is. There is no one like her. Twinkle, have you ever wondered who is the one who links the prophets and the imams? Twinkle blinks his gleaming eyes and says, Isn't it say the Fatima peace be upon her? Daddy star winks in approval. Yes, she is the link between Nabua and Imama. Look at the sky. The dawn is about to break. In this twilight, let me whisper to you a lullaby. The night may end, but her virtues will remain untold. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, do you know what the virtues are? Of Zahra, the radiant star, they are all heavenly bizarre. Mola Ali's partner in despair She is truthful and sincere You won't find anyone else Titled the most virtuous and fair She is the source of warm shelter Equally for all without fear be them wealthy or deprived She is generous to all mankind She is the perfect role model For all of us in the life sphere She is the reason for happiness And our beloved prophet's cheer 
Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Now it's time to close your eyes. Thus be his Zahra you shall recite. To sleep in peace and rise in delight.